go. Son of a bitch. Well, there's only one way to fix this. Sucks to do it, but we got to. Until we find Diamond, we can't go to the Nether. Well, that was kind of pointless. There is major, major mob activity somewhere underneath my house, and it is really starting to bug the crap out of me. Now, unfortunately, um, I did some rearranging in the house, and I accidentally picked up a piece of leather. It was in a chest. Unfortunately, that gave us an achievement off camera. The, um, cow tipper one, which I would like to have done on camera, but I didn't realize that just by picking it up out of my in, uh, out of my chest that it would have counted as an achievement. I thought I actually had to kill the cow first, but, uh, well, we're going to let that here was I, I moved this chest full of the food, and the coal and everything back here to where the kitchen is, well, what the kitchen would be, I guess, if I really pay any attention to this place, and I moved all the precious stuff, like iron, gold, and diamonds over here, and that's, these are the diamonds we got like way back when but now we need to get more diamonds to trigger the achievement and I know where they're at what's been going on is if you remember last time we had a uh, a serious lag issue I was building the portal my disk space had reached critical levels uh, yeah go figure brand new laptop in January or in December and I spent three months recording and it went through breezed through 560 gigs so I had to go buy a new uh, terabyte external hard drive so I could move everything over that I've done already to that and free up some space so now we have more space but before that I had to go and um, I wanted to search out the diamonds see if we could find diamonds without you guys on camera because I didn't have the space to record and I feel bad because a lot of cool stuff happened there's a lot of great huge big caverns I want to show you later on uh, unfortunately we've already been through them I've kind of spam torched them to kind of keep things from being too out of hand there was a couple of times I thought I was gonna die but uh, we'll you know we'll go see those later so, uh, another thing I did was I had some coffee beans from our trip to the jungle to find milk and I what I did you can grow a coffee farm to make, uh, I'm not, I keep calling it coffee, it's cocoa beans, I apologize. Cocoa beans. So, what happens here is you take the cocoa beans and you put up some jungle wood. Now, it doesn't have to be a tree. It can just be one piece of wood, but you need clearance one space out on any side. So, I can't put two here because it won't grow right. But if I put one there, see how small it is? It will eventually grow into this. So, you can set up these elaborate, uh, trunks of jungle wood and grow your own cocoa beans so now i can put one there but i can't put one here so i'm gonna let that one grow so i don't kill it but you see the idea here that what's going on so let's let me just get these going so we can get some new ones because cookies are pretty okay, good we gotta go find the, the the diamonds so i have with me a couple buckets of water because well <laughs> They're not in the, the best of places to, to go get. So I wandered all over the place, all the way back to spawn and everything, to try to find uh, a cave for diamonds. And it turned out it was just like right over here. Once again, I go all that way for nothing, because it's right over here. Big huge hole I missed. I totally missed. So we got to go down there and look. There's a big old ravine down there. And it's pretty sweet. So here we are. Whoa. There we go. Yep. Yo, jeez. Oh crap, did you see that bat was on fire? Oh, the poor bastard. He was, he like flew, he was like a fireball. Oh, damn. Where were the hell were those damn diamonds at? There was a big, huge cave. Crap, I want to spend an entire episode trying to find where I was at before. Ow. Ow. Oh, man. Oh, shit.
Damn. Alright, we may die just trying to get to the diamonds that I've already found this bucket up here. Nerd pull up, get the bucket of water. There we go. Alright, uh, let's see here. Luckily, I have marked down the coordinates. So yeah, there was this huge, big hole down here somewhere. And in it, I found a big lake of lava. And on the far side, I could see diamonds. And now, I've decided to bring you all down here, and now I can't find it. Much typical of anything I do in this game. There's stuff. Oh, crap. Look at that. Oh, that poor son of a bitch. They keep flying into the... All right, I gotta go up. It's up somewhere. Here, oh. Damn it, they just... Those poor bats. <coughs> okay, sorry about that. We had to abort mission for a second. I had to go back and get some food. I was about dead. Um, just, I fell a couple of times and that took my, keep my health down, so... Uh, came, went back to get some food. I get the, you know, you can see the fish I have here in my, my hand here. So, we had to get back, and we slept, and then we came back. So, here we are. This is more, uh, like the area I came into here. Ooh, son of a... Damn. Didn't want him to blow up. But you can see, look at this big... Here is where I found this big, huge cavern. Look at this sucker. This is immense. I mean, it goes all the way down. There's there's a skeleton down there. We're not going to go down there. But I just couldn't believe how huge this thing was. This cave system. So I was pretty impressed with it. Oh, son of a... No, damn... zombie up here somewhere. He's kind of stuck in the wall. Okay, so you can tell we're right underneath the uh, the sand here. At the top. So it was really close by. I was surprised how close by it was. But we really need to get down here and find that stupid lava lake. Wait. Wait, don't you... I was going to say, don't you see me? Uh, two sp skeletons over there. One's gonna die. I'll knock the other one under the water so he dies too. Bye! <laughs> he, uh, I'm not gonna deal with him. <laughs> I just I don't wanna. I don't have the capacity to deal with him. Right now. Oh! Oh! What is this? Oh! Look at that! Oh, and a creeper to boot. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, let's get rid of this guy quickly. Nice. Wasn't expecting to find a, tr a dungeon down here. I didn't see that before. Oh, look at all these damn zombies. Get one of them to blow up and take out the rest of them, really. Yeah, did, did most of the work. Excellent. Bonus. We found a damn. Oh, jeez. Let's go see what we found out of the dungeon. Yeah. My damn hunger's already down again. I was really hoping to not spend the entire episode trying to get the diamonds because... Oh, another bucket, some gun... A lot of gunpowder and some bread. Oh, did he spawn? Ah. A moody sentence. Alright, well... We got everything out of the chest. Let's just move on. We're still looking for that stupid... 
Why can't I find it? <laughs> ah! Wait a second. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, shh. Oh. Crap. Where am I at? <laughs> I heard a... I heard a creeper hit. Oh. Get behind me. Where'd he go? Jesus. This is gonna get bad. Oh, Jesus. There's a, they're everywhere. <laughs> well, the good news is I found it. The bad news is I'm stuck in a major danger zone. Shit. There's, oh, oh, crap, crap. Where are you at? All figures. Oh, for Pete's sake. What the hell? <laughs> nice to one-shot him, but man. All right. Uh, we yeah, we're here. We're here. This it's around here. I remember. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, there's the lake of lava. Okay, down here is where I, I sort of peeked it. I fell down there by mistake, and I sort of peeked. So it. here we go. We got to get down here. And what we're gonna do first is we are going to make a bridge. Now, normally, most people would just make. Oh, that's not a good place for. Oh, oh, where are you at? Where are you at? Oh, oh. But most people would make a bridge <clears throat> just out of dirt or whatever. And that would be fine, except the fact that we are dealing with way too much lava and way too many monsters. So we're not even going to go there. We're going to just. We're going to build an obsidian bridge. And of course, you do that normal way. Okay, remember I we, we talked about that trick before when we were doing the farm. I didn't think it worked, but it actually does work. What you have to do is... See, there are the diamonds over there. What you have to do is to only take from the middle. So it does work to do a three-hole infinite water source. Unfortunately, I don't like to do it that way. I like to do uh, the, f the four-hole method because it you can take it from anywhere. You don't take it just from the middle. Yeah, we, we, we are just not dealing with uh, lava today. I don't want to die. And we got achievement. Get diamonds. Excellent. And there's a lot of them, too. Yeah, I like that. Now, we just have to get out of here and survive. Take a little bit of lapis while we're at it. Why not? Oh, shit. I'm sorry, did I... Well, apparently you've taken a lot of damage in the fall. Alright, let's get the hell out of Dodge. Let's get back to the house. Find my way back to the house. I knew you were somewhere. Oh, I didn't know you brought your brother. I can't get to the house. I was just trying to switch to my sword. My, I couldn't scroll fast enough in my, my inventory. Oh, 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 I don't want to go down here. Do I? <laughs> I know I'm bypassing a lot of iron. And All right, we're just going to get it, but I'm using the iron pick to get out of it. All right. I rode this down, and I covered it up so I didn't have to get swept away. But we're going to just take it up as the elevator, the express elevator out of hell. Let's... Yeah. Where's the damn door at? Okay, here we go. Damn me, I turned off that that visibility. Now I can't see any of Where are you at, you son of a bitch? Oh, oh, I was gonna say I knew you were I could hear you coming somewhere. Alright. The real trick is not dying on the way back. <laughs> Of course, now we'll get out of the hole. It'll be nighttime. There'll be monsters everywhere. And it'll be a, like a mad dash to get back to the house. But if I happen to die outside, I'm a little bit better off than dying out down here. The simple fact that I don't have to go underground to get all my stuff. What the hell? Oh, thank God. All right. There's the hole. Let's get out of here. 
Yep, it's dark outside. Figures! Eh. All manner of beast will be after us. Okay, now just run like the dickens. Get the hell out of here. Uh. <laughs> Another achievement down. That means we can go to the nether. Oh, I'm so excited for that. You can tell the sarcasm in my voice. The nether is not fun. So there you can see. Look at look, look at here. Look at this. We got more coffee now. Or cook. Damn it. Cocoa beans grown all over the place. So I'll we'll, we will make a. See, and I got six out of that. Those two produced three each. So easy way to make a coffee farm. All right. <clears throat> coffee, 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 coffee. Get out of my system. They're cocoa beans, you dummy. So once we get settled in a new place, we are going to uh, put up a nice big coffee. Uh, damn it. So, wheat on either side. Coco cocoa bean. Cocoa bean. Set it right in the middle. Gives you eight cookies. Those cookies... I mean, the yield alone is enough to, uh, to invest in doing that, because that... that that's good to get away from having to rely on, you know, waiting for wheat to grow or waiting for carrots to grow. Oh, I got a potato. I didn't tell you about that. I got a potato out of one of the zombies I killed looking for that, uh, looking for that mine. So, we have potatoes now to, uh, grow. And I, probably, I think I put some in the, in the old garden. Actually, why don't we... Let's, let's hold off on a second. Since we have, um, we can, we can nail down three, you know, three of these. So let's take care of the uh, portal this time. Alright, uh, we're going to do this real quick and come back out. We're not ready to go into the portal for a long periods of time. So, yep, we got. We need to go deeper. <laughs> I, I just don't really like going to the nether unprepared. And we are going to take a lot of supplies with us to uh, survive our stay there. So you can see here I got the potatoes. Potatoes, carrots growing. Got a nice little little garden going. Uh, as always, we do it on camera so you can see my, me going into creative mode and going back out of creative mode as to not be cheating. Because there's a diamond there. I could easily take that diamond if you weren't watching me at all the times. Boom. That's gone. We got, the, we got that. We got that. Attack and destroy a monster. We oh, we took that one. No, that can't be right. We had to have done that separately. The snipe. That's got to be the sniper. The sniper duel is that one. So we can take that one off the board. I didn't realize we had them out of order like that. So I apologize. So we can do some more next time. But I think we're gonna go to the Nether because we need to get some things for the enchant enchanting table and our bookshelf. Now. The on a rail one, I think we're going to have to go investigate that uh, abandoned mine shaft that I found in the water a while back because you can make. I have enough iron probably to make a good set of rails, but it's so much cheaper to just go into an abandoned mine shaft and take the rails because they're already there. You don't have to make them. That's it. Thank you all for playing with me. We'll see you next time. Take care.